Why is it never in focus? <laughs> My camera wants to focus on this beautiful muffin. Hi guys! I just wanted to film a little video to show you guys an update on my little peanuts growing inside of me. If you guys haven't watched the previous video about me being pregnant, this is the follow-up. So I'm at 13 weeks now, so this is what the baby looks like. Look, he's like turning around, he's like moving his legs and like turning around and like doing this. Like how cute is that? Like it's the cutest thing I've ever seen. Anyways, I wanted to show you guys that and also I got some Columbus Cafe um, goods and I got them at um, for really cheap because it was the leftovers basically. It's uh, this app called Too Good To Go and basically um you have like a pickup time and you have to go pick them up before closing and i happen to finish work at around this time so i can go pick it up and it's just next to the nail salon i work at so this is what i got for only 3.99 euros i don't know how many dollars is it it is maybe four dollars four dollars maybe i don't know but it's look at that it looks amazing this is like maybe apple muffin chocolate i i got also a big cookie and i got this egg like i think it's a cheese and bacon muffin so let's eat cheers mmm Mm. Oh my god. This is everything. <gasps> it's so good. Yeah, there's eggs inside. It's an egg muffin. Mm. Mm. I want to thank you guys so, so much for all your comments and also your messages on Instagram. I read all your DMs and you guys, it really warmed my heart because some of you guys also are pregnant or have kids and we are in the same situation. I, I feel like this is crazy. Mmm. Also, I don't know the gender yet. I will know at around five, around five months. So it's going to be in July. July 6th. So I can't wait for July. <gasps> mm. This is my belly, by the way. I took this picture maybe like two days ago. So this is what it looks like. And this one I took this morning. So I'm definitely showing. <laughs> mm. This is so good. Like, just one of this is going to be like $5, I think, or $4. But I got all of this for this price, so it's crazy. By the way, pickup time was until 8 p.m. and I finished at 8 p.m. and I didn't, like, I forgot about it. So I, like, got off work a little bit early, like, maybe, like, maybe it was 7.50, like, 6 or, 7, or 57 or something. And I was, like, 
going to just go and then i remembered i was like, oh my god it's closing soon i have to go so i went there and they were closing it was 8 p.m and they were closing i was like please no the leftovers and they had the bag ready for me because i reserved it and they just handed me the bag and it was it was good but i was scared i wouldn't be able to pick it up last time i got a french taco and i also had some salad from the italian italian restaurant but and with some like pizza bread which I think was good, but I was not expecting, like, it was pretty expensive. It was way more than that. I think it was $7 or something for one meal. And I got three. So it was like 20 something. And we had like a bag of like pizza breads and three salads. And, but I think the salads like were not that big in my opinion. Um, there were no dressing. It was just like tomatoes, ham. It was a caprese salad, so with mozzarella or burrata, which I think is good. But the other ones were like. Um, gorgonzola cheese, I think. This is not bad. Mm. This is bomb. But I think the best deal is Columbus Cafe and the other, um, the other bakery. The other bakery you can get like four tarts and one um, pastry, which I think is super bomb. Oh my god, what should we have next? Should we have this cookie? I really want to try this. I don't know what this is. This is some kind of like choco balls. And there is some kind of stuff on it. I hope it's caramel. Not sure. But anyways, I've been like craving some sweet stuff a lot since I'm pregnant. <laughs> I've been craving a lot of fruits also, like um, strawberries. I thought it was a myth, but it's actually true, you guys. I was craving strawberries so bad. Like, no matter how expensive they were, like I would just buy them. Oh my god, it's filled. <gasps> it's caramel, I think. What? Mm. Oh my god. It's salted caramel. Mm. Mm. What? Crazy. Mm. How am I gonna eat that? It's so big. Wow. I hope it's caramel on top. I knew it was caramel. I knew it. Caramel and chocolate. Yeah. Hmm. Anyway, the baby's growing super healthily. I did all my blood tests. I just need to do like one vaccine. 
Okay, I'm good to go. I also did the test for Down syndrome and I will get the results in like a week or something. Mm. Mm. Wow. Mm. These are white chocolate balls. Oh my god. I'm so happy right now. Mm. Mm. Amazing. So now we've been thinking about names also, which is so exciting. I have so many ideas for like girl and boy. But I really have this feeling that it's going to be a boy. Like, I, I just know it, you know? I just feel, I just feel there is like, I feel like it's a boy. I don't know how to explain that, but... Oh my god, it's filled with apples. What? I knew this one was gonna be apple. You know, this is the best part the filling. Mmm. Look how fluffy that is. Mm. My god. So, tomorrow is my day off. I'm going to go pick up my package from the post office. I think it's going to be Tokyo Treat or Sakurako um, Spox because I renewed the contract with them. So, I'm going to be working with them for another six, six months. It's going to be so good for my pregnancy cravings, you guys know. My God. So I'm so thankful for them. This apple muffin is everything. What? I feel like they have so many different types. Last time I went there, I had the chocolate chip muffin, blueberry muffin, and just like sugar egg muffin. Like, I said egg muffin, but it was like a muffin, but it really smelled like eggs. And it was bomb. And now I have like two different types. Like, how many types of muffin do I have? Do they have? Mm -hmm. It's so good. I said I was gonna eat else healthy, but <laughs> but I just had a sandwich for lunch, so I was pretty hungry. And usually I have, I just have salads anyway for lunch. But my siblings were here for a few days because it was a public holiday in France. So I invited them to my apartment and they spent um, four days with us. Was it like three? Yeah, three full days. And we had so much delicious food, like pizza, chicken, 
corn dogs like Korean corn dogs but I think they were better in Korea like the French ones like they still have some things to improve you know they were not as good as the ones I had in Korea for sure mm. But anyways, everything's going good. I can't wait to show you guys my next ultrasound in July and the gender reveal. It's going to be crazy. I so want to know, but I know it's going to be a boy. I know it. Sometimes you just know, you know? So, I was thinking about the name Temin for boy. So, it's pretty easy to pronounce, I think, even for French people. It, look, it sounds like Timmy or Tommy. I really wanted a name like that. That would be easy to pronounce in French also. And for a girl, I was thinking about Leah. Because my boyfriend's last name is Joe. He's gonna get his name, so. Oh! So, so, it smells like macadamia and chocolate. Oh, I love these types of cookies, like the like chewy ones. Mmm! Wow. Anyways. His last name is going to be Joe, so when you pronounce it, it's like Julia. Julia in French is like Julie, means pretty. <laughs> so I thought it was really cute and pretty for a girl's name, Julia. Okay, it sounds like Julia, but... When you say the full name, like it's gonna be Julia, but her name is gonna be Leah. My boyfriend, he's actually good with anything, like any name, like he loves both names, so I think it's gonna be up to me. <laughs> this is bomb. Wow. Hmm. But I want to thank you guys so much for the comments and the DMs, the messages. It means a lot to me. Like I told you, I feel like you guys are part of them family, part of the Miamu fam, and I have a little Miamu inside of me, a baby Miamu. <laughs> so I think that's so cute. I hope he loves food like me, because <laughs> his his dad also loves food, so. Can't wait to show you guys more footage and pictures. But look, here you can see his little feet. 
can actually see one foot. And here you can see his hand, like that. So he's like fully developed, like, he's just the side of my hand. He's just so small. Even less, I think. He's seven centimeters. And I just can like I keep like watching the pictures and everything. I keep looking at them. Even the video. And I was so happy to have the video. And this is the 4D uh, 3D image, which I know is kind of scary. It looks like an alien, but <laughs> you have to kind of imagine, you know, what he's gonna look like. This cookie is so good. <gasps> I swear. I'm gonna go there every day. <laughs> it's crazy. I wasn't planning on having that for dinner, but I thought, you know, why not? Why not? Do a little mukbang. Well, I'll talk to you guys about what's going on and everything. Also, I need to change my nails. They've been growing like crazy. I did like a real rabbit here and here also. They're like so nasty now. <laughs> It's been more than a month. Hmm. Hmm. Are you full, baby? I make sure he never needs anything. I just fill him up with food. Don't worry, tomorrow we're gonna eat healthy, okay? I make sure to get plenty of rest, make sure I'm never like starving or anything. So yeah, I will see you guys for my next update. You're gonna probably see this video um, around like 14 weeks, depends when I have time to edit and upload because I have also my work schedule I have to adapt to so we'll see but I think it's gonna be a super quick video to edit anyway but the Tokyo treat and Sakurako video is gonna come up also I'm gonna film it um, if it's not tomorrow it's next week or next Sunday so yeah hope you guys enjoyed and thank you so much for your support and yeah thank you so much for having so much interest in the little peanuts and i will see you guys soon i hope you guys have an amazing day evening night wherever you are and yeah see you guys soon bye mamu fam love you